Well, like so many of our landmarkers, I've been involved with Landmark Trust since I was a student. I've been staying in amazing properties uh, for such a long time. So when I heard, or got a call, in fact, that, that there was an availability for a trusteeship, I jumped at the chance. It's an incredibly simple charity, and it has two missions. One is to rescue historic properties around the country that would not otherwise survive. And the second, an equally important mission is to promote enjoyment of those buildings. Because if you think about it, what's the point of heritage unless people are enjoying it? And Landmark offers this really wonderful proposition of, the, of you being able to inhabit, enjoy and live in our buildings as if they were your own. It's a self-sustaining charity. And that means our 200 buildings are able to look after themselves. The income they produce from Landmarkers staying and using them goes to maintain not just the buildings themselves, with a considerable maintenance budget that we have every year, but it also looks after the administration cost of the charity. It's a very unusual model. And that means that all the new money that we raise can go into rescuing new buildings in peril around the country. We have a programme called 50 for Free, which we open up to charities to nominate individuals or groups to come and stay in our buildings, which I think is a wonderful thing and it's incredibly popular and it's brilliant actually for some of the many people involved. We also have a, a scheme for students where universities can send groups of students to use our buildings for free to work in, something that I think is very good and inclusive and helpful to society in general. And of course one area that we're particularly proud of is our craftspeople and our tradesmen. We want to work so hard to make sure that we can preserve traditional crafts and make sure that those skills are passed on to the next generation. Yeah, it's really interesting. It covers a really broad property portfolio. We have land, we have commercial property like shops, we have houses, we have cottages. We have all sorts of things that people have left to us in their wills. And collectively, that's managed by Landmark and produces an income every year that goes straight into the charitable work that we do. Gifts in wills are very important to Landmark. They can make all the difference to us. They can help us begin to investigate a project. They can help us complete a project. One of the things that a legacy can do is unlock matching funds. And by that I mean we often have donors or grantors who will match funds pound for pound. So that means if we have a legacy of £100, it can often be matched by a further donation of a further £100, therefore doubling the impact that any donation might have. Well, I can speak from my own perspective. I've left something in my will for Landmark, and I know and I'm confident that that means that that, at some point, will be able to help Landmark rescue new buildings, help people to enjoy staying in those buildings, help ensure that we preserve craft skills and trades. The other brilliant thing about leaving something in your will for Landmark is it doesn't cost you a penny now, and yet you get the benefit of really feeling part of the Landmark Trust family. You don't have to tell us that you've left us a legacy at all. And similarly, we don't ask for proof that you have. But tell us. And if you do tell us, it's a wonderful thing because it would really help us be able to make sure that we can direct your donation in the right way, into projects that you love, into crafts that you care about, and into parts of the country that mean something to you. What I would like to see is that the Landmark Trust becomes the home for people all over the country who have property or land that they want to leave in their wills, but they're not quite sure where to leave it or how to, because we have an incredible expertise in being able to look after property in our legacy estate, and then that will produce income that will help the mission of the Landmark Trust. I really hope that you will consider making a gift of a legacy to the Landmark Trust. It's something that I've done, it's something that I care about, and it will mean that this charity can go on rescuing historic buildings in jeopardy all over the country.